Hello, Libra, Gemini, Mercury, Earth, Aquarius, Sagittarius. If this resonates, this message is for you. Once again, guys, this is a collection of energies. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Don't try to fit these stories. If it don't fit, it just don't fit. Just hit the like, subscribe, notification bell, come back. Well, check out all the other content that I got down there. Enjoy it. It's for you. All right? And once again, this is a collection. So if you want to book a personal reading, feel free to click on that description box. You get all my emails, all my websites, all that good stuff. So feel free to connect with me. All right? All right. So here we go. Lord is in the building. I'm going to tell you right now, it's a higher power in the building. Okay? Spirit is talking today. God said what he said. You hear what would you hear what I'm talking about? God is in the building one-on-one -on -one as I said that. Alright, so let's get started. So Mercury is in the building. Mercury talks about communication, speaking up, speaking out for yourselves. Gemini, Libra, air signs in the building, guys. I got all three air signs in the building, so I'm definitely, definitely. Definitely talking about some air signs that want to keep holding on, guys. Y'all don't want to let go. Spirit say it's a never ending story. You guys just stay confused. Fork in the world, y'all stay undecided. Y'all don't know what y'all want to do. It's round and round. You guys got to make up your mind and ground yourselves, okay? That's this is the message I'm giving y'all. We got two towers in the building, and of course, Lord God is in the building and they and lord want to talk to these divine masculines these air signs so the divine masculine you could be a libra or in your chart okay gemini okay you could be a divine masculine and i feel like god want to communicate to you guys god is trying to communicate communicate with you guys and you gonna get y'all towers on y'all head you keep sitting there acting like ain't nobody talking to y'all Okay? Balance your masculine and feminine energies and take control. And maybe y'all aren't. So let's just keep it going. Let me break it down. Because that may be what it is. Because what came out is the change in the wind. So God is saying make some changes. Because the tower. Tower is here. Could be cold where y'all at. And then I got another tower. Tower. So that's two towers. The Lord God is putting two towers in the air, guys. Tower time tower time tower means a change whether it's a good change or not now Libra you could be causing towers divine masculines you can create towers on your own as well if you're ending stuff we got mercury maybe you communicating and standing up for yourself and that's a good thing hopefully that's what's going on and hopefully you over there making changes and you causing towers why I say that because we got the earth sign here could be a Capricorn Taurus Virgo Okay, or you could be an earth sign with Libra, Gemini in your chart. This message is for you. Mercury is in the building. Mercury, talk about a Mercury retrograde. Something going out and coming back in. 333 three, three on the clock. Somebody coming back around. Mercury also talks about communication. Divine masculines, so y'all want to communicate to who? Hmm, let me wonder. Let me figure it out. To your divine feminists. You definitely had two towers. God and brought a couple of towers to your head. So hopefully you guys are waking up at this point. Because God said what he said. Now, y'all can see that. God said what he said. All right masculine so i hope you guys are causing these towers and communicating to these carmita carmichaels that y'all don't want them no more and if not it's gonna happen okay because god said what he said all right so we're gonna keep it going so i basically said okay with the towers we got fork in the road so gemini you could be the one with a fork in the road you having some confusion here going on and i'm guessing it's because we got aquarius and a sag down here that's pissed off Highly pissed, okay. So this could be one of y'all two, uh, Carmita Carmichael's chat. And check out my "Why You Mad" video. Look what four 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 is. I said that Aquarius and Sag is pissed off. So you guys cross towers. What's towers? Towers is what the God calls, or towers is what you guys are causing 
You're ending things. You're making them changes. You're communicating. You're telling people you don't want them. 5 or 5 on the clock. And they mad. They mad. They mad, bitch. Because you're making changes, okay? You're changing with the wind. You're changing with what God said. You're communicating to these people. Libra, I feel like you made a major change right now. And these people is not happy about it. This Aquarius and this Sagittarius. But who gives a hoot? Because we got Mars on the board. Okay? They want to go to war with you. They're mad because you're making changes. And they want to fight. And they could be lying to you still. Or you could have snuck on snap. You could be lying to them. Now take your pick. But this is what I feel. These people was lying to your face. Lying is just some lying ass people. And they go round and round. They lie to you. Now this could be something that y'all still dealing with. Or you guys have completely made the changes. But God is saying y'all need to make these changes because towers are here. I feel like towers is dropping right and left every day. Every day. When y'all wake up, you got a tower going on. Okay? Because someone is lying. Lying about their feelings. And it's, just, it's just a never ending story. It's just round and round and round. They just keep lying to you. They keep sneaking off. And yeah, they're mad. Because you're having an awakening. Libra, Gemini, y'all are waking up. Y'all realizing that these people ain't nothing but some liars or some sneaks and some cheats. Lying and cheating. Them two could have been cheating on each other. We have hers and hers. I told you there's a gay couple out here that's over here secretly cheating on each other. And I think you are walking to that, uh, Libra or Gemini. One of y'all, both of y'all could have communicated. I don't know. But somebody woke up to this Aquarius and Sagittarius down here. Or they mad because you are getting an awakening and they can't keep lying to you no more. Because you know what? You got tired, Divine Masculine. You said this is a never-ending dang on story and I got to get out of here. And you caused the tower. Boom. Tower hit, you realize you got to go. Alright? Here planes. Also, this is telling you, Divine Masculine, if y'all consistently keep sitting there, it's going to be a never-ending karmic cycle that you're going to have on your head because y'all just sitting there and you're not moving. Hopefully you guys are, but if you're not, this is a message for you as well. So you guys, you're sitting there acting confused like y'all don't know which way to go. It don't matter which way you go, just get the hell up out of the way y'all live. God will provide which way to go. God will see that you get in the right direction, but you've got to have faith. That the direction in the towers is here. Now you got to go on and move and make that move. And you can't be scared. Especially if you were the Capricorn towards Virgo. You got to make that move. Don't be so afraid of, of, of changing your foundation. Because a foundation is just what it is. It's going to still be there. Even if you do make changes. It's like a tree. The tree bends and, 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 and goes back and forth. It don't matter. But that foundation will always be there. So don't ever think that you're giving up on anything. You're just making a change. What you're making a change to? Something old and ending the new. I mean, ending the old and beginning the new. And how you do that? You cause towers. Towers. Shocking moments. They didn't expect it. They was mad at you. They thought you was going to stay there forever. They thought they was going to be a round and round, never end the story. But it ain't. Because you know what? You made a decision to get the hell up out of there. And good for you, Divine Masculine. You made a decision. And Gemini, if you were confused and you didn't know which way to go, and these people had you confused and what direction to take, you caused the tower. It will be coming if it ain't came by autumn. And you know what? You will decide on what you need to do. Ten on the board, that means it's an ending. Three on the chain, so that means the higher power is in the building. God said what he said, and it is over. You had a solid foundation, and you're trying to figure out which way to go. But guess what? God already showed you which way to go, and that's a tower on your and they, It's a tower. You created a tower, Divine Masculines. And if that's what y'all did, and that's what y'all communicated, kudos to you. God said what he said, and he in the building. Congratulations, guys. You guys are stepping into your divine masculine energy and y'all proving these bitches, bitter bitches and bitter bums wrong. Thank you. And those of you that are still stuck there, acting confused and acting like y'all don't want to move, God is going to move it for you. <laughs> God is going to create these two towers, one in the wintertime, one in the fall, or it may have been already, I don't know, take your pick, but he will move that mountain for you. Because these people are studying lying to you. And this study going over and over again. And God ain't going to keep letting that happen. 
and they could be bitter bitches, bitter bomb down here and be mad. No one cares, okay? No one cares. All right, so let's get started. Let me take a breather. Whoo! Yeah, I feel the energy. The energy's just revved up. Y'all got me revved up. Y'all got me going. All right, so let me get these uh, oracles out of here. God is watching too, by the way. Now, some of y'all, y'all keep lying to these Aquarius and Sagittarius. They could be getting mad because they know y'all lying. And God is going to come in and create a tower. You guys need to communicate to your, your karmics that y'all don't want them no more. I just feel like y'all already have. But if you haven't, God said what he said. The Lord said it. What he said it now. Okay. And, and, and these people that's mad over here in this corner, they can just stay mad. No one cares. They be mad by themselves. All right. All right. So, let's just clarify some things. First of all, we're going to clarify. We're going to clarify these towers. All right? Because somebody got some towers up on their stuff. I'm trying to tell you right now. So, let's see what these towers is. Because I feel like somebody walked away. These towers is. These this Libra communicated. They don't want you no more. They in love with somebody else. This Gemini communicated. I don't want to deal with it no more. I don't want you no more, Sagittarius. I'm in love with someone else. Alright. Or, I don't know. This could be something going on. Let's see. <laughs> Alright, because I feel fine. Uh, yeah, they got their power. That's right, Divine Masculine. You better get it. You better get it. You better get it. Go on and do your thing. It's a celebration. That's right. Others of you, if you're sitting there, you're getting towers on your skull. I'm telling you tell you right now, you better make some changes. Yep, you better take that leap. And I feel like y'all taking that leap. I'm, I, I feel it. I feel the energy. All right, let's keep it going. So let's get this first tower here. Let's see, pull these down a little bit. All right, let's go to this first tower, Holy Spirit. 22, 12, 22, as I said that. What happened in this first town? Tell us what we need to show me what I need to see. Yeah, what did I say? I'm in love with someone else. I can't make this shit up. Divine masculine found his self love and he calls the town. Boom, heart chakra. I'm in love with someone else. That's what the communication was. And boom, tower. Rejection. Rejection. Now, some of y'all bored. <laughs> y'all still sitting there. Okay, but it's a tower, so I feel like you did realize, hey, I got a destiny. I got to go. I'm in love with someone else. I got to step up and be the divine masculine that I am. All right? Others of you, you need to leave. You're getting beat up beside your skull, and y'all still sitting there, and you're bored. Spirit is saying you better wake up and do what you need to do. Make these changes now. But I feel like changes has came. So it was a rejection. You realize you love this person. This is your destiny. And you reject this person. Okay. Good for you. Queen of Pentacles. So yeah. Rejected this wife. I feel like some of y'all feel like. The Divine Feminine is the Queen of Pentacles. Someone solid, stable. You realize you want someone solid, stable. But we also got an Earth sign down here. So what's this Queen of Pentacles spirit? Is this a good Queen of Pentacles? Or well, is this one ain't no good? Knight of Swords. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. So this Queen of Pentacles, yes. Whoever this Divine Feminine is, your masculine is on its way. He is running to you, okay? He's trying to catch up with the motorcycle. The motorcycle going so fast, he can't even reach it. He's going so fast to you, okay? He has had his awakening. God has basically slapped him with them towers. <laughs> and, yeah, he know who his destiny is, and he's gone. He could have rejected this Gemini. Gemini, you could have rejected this Sag. Sag, you could have, you know. I feel like you rejected this Aquarius and Sag, or this Sag down here. And yeah, and you know who is your solid, stable person. You guys are having awakenings here. You're waking up. Yep, you're waking up to your destiny. So that's good. 
judgment. Yeah, you connect them with your higher self. That's great. Let's keep it going. All right, one more with the tower. Yeah, what did I say? No longer running after these options over here. This Aquarius had you confused, didn't she? She had you all confused and wrapped up in all her magic and her lying and her sneakiness and all her sex addictions and all the stuff she thought she'd keep you stuck in. And you set yourself free. Good job, Divine Masculine. That's what I'm talking about. Set yourself free. You don't need to be with this old sneaky link. Look what she's doing. She's still lying. Even though you called and told her you don't want her no more, she's still lying. So guess what? It goes round and round, Spirit say. That's all she do. That's all she do. And she mad about it because you done left her out. You ain't confused no more. You awoke to who? Who you awoke to? Your love. Yourself. Love of self means love of someone else. 1555. Love of your divine feminine. That's right. Good job. I love this read. Let's go. Yeah, ain't nothing to cut that bitch off. You cut that bitch off, Libra. Gemini. That's good. That's great. Yeah, working with a king of wands. Okay, so she over here working with this Sag over here. So this a male Sagittarius over here. Now they want to be fighting. Both of them lying and, and sneaking around. These sneaky links. Uh-huh, now they confused. Mm-hmm. Playing my games with this Sagittarius over here. Yeah. Yeah, having sex. What did I say? King of Wands, Queen of Wands. That's a sexual couple down here. So they over here having sex. See, and you caught them in the act and cut their ass off. That's for some of you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Being a male whore. Selling their body for cash. Doing all that shit up in that moon. Like what now? Mm-hmm. What the? Yeah, being immature, spirit saying. And it was a reveal about a child. So, yeah, it's the Sagittarius. He the father. Yep. Judgment. Boom. Could have came out in court. High Priestess knew it, didn't she? And she knew it, too. She lied to you, Libra. That's what she did. She been lied to you. She was trying to tell you in the first place. Person wasn't no good for you, no way. You over there just stuck like Chuck for somebody that's a hoe. Tower. All right, good. So you cut them off. Let's go. Let's go with this other tower over here. Let's go, Holy Spirit. What's this tower? Look, tower clarifies by tower. Two top ta three towers. No, it's just tower, tower, tower. Oh, man, they have an awakening like it ain't no other over there. God waking and shaking everything up over there. That's good. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Knight of Wands in the reverse. Yeah. Ain't no player no more. He in love. Ain't nothing to cut them hoes off. They don't love you no way. Why you even waiting? waiting? He ain't waiting no more. Ain't no more waiting. Uh-oh. <laughs> Ten of Wands. Yeah. Tower. 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 Clarified by the tower. Two, two, three towers on the board. Come on now. God is in the building. He said what he said. I told you he said what he said now. When God say what he say, it don't matter what the hell we say at all. It's what God say at the end of the day. God is in control. Better recognize that, Carmita, while you're over here. Over here throwing your wine up everywhere. Yeah, he released that little whore down here, this Aquarius over here, this little sex addict. Over here and had a baby by somebody else. What's the tower? Come on, let's go. We in the building. Yeah. Wishes being fulfilled. Tower. So all that wishes you was doing, Aquarius, in that moonlight that you thought nobody see, going back on your head. Tower. What's another tower? Yeah, that stuff you was doing in that home, that that in that in hiding in that moonlight. Mm -hmm. You was wishing all that bad luck on divine feminine, divine masculine. Yeah, tower. And also, Libra, you could have definitely healed yourself. <laughs> Ain't no match for an empress. Ain't no match for no empress. I try to tell everybody in the world, y'all better wake up, people. You better wake up. Tower. All right. 
So she was hiding the fact that she was pregnant by this old man whore because she was sex addict over here being immature sexually and then ended up getting pregnant by somebody else. And then she lied to you, Libra, or Gemini, take your pick, and said she was pregnant by probably both of y'all. Okay, and y'all both over here thinking you got a child. And now come to find out, she wasn't pregnant by nobody. And she thought she had a victory with the Empress over here trying to fake like the Empress. But it ain't no match for an Empress, Aquarius, or Sash 2020 on the clock. Ain't no match. This could have been in 2020 she told you she was pregnant or something like that. Thinking she was going to win. No, I'm the winner. We're the winners. Divine Feminine Empresses is the winner. Ain't no match for us. And you seen that platform, you seen the Empress, you realized the Empress was telling the truth the whole dang on time, and you moved forward. Good job, Libra, Gemini, Divine Masculines. Y'all waking up. Good job. Knows it, so I must be telling the truth. Good job. Emperor was on your team the whole time. That's what I was trying to tell you. Good job. Finally stop believing this lying ass query. You hear that, Mona? Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. I'm the true magician. We the true magicians. Yeah, that's the true magicians. Not these old Amazon, fake-ass Amazon book magicians. We are the true magicians. We're the Matrix. We're the, we're the Matrix. We're the Matrix. We're, we're the Matrix. <laughs> All right, let me stop. I'm getting hyped. Exactly. Trying to do magic on the Empress. You can't. Your fake-ass Empress can't do no magic on a real life Empress that connects with the whole universe, that connects with God Almighty. What you thought, girl? What you thought? You better. You got to reevaluate your brain cells. Tower for you. Tower. You lying ass, fake-ass Empress. Tower. What's this magician? Yeah, world is completed. So, Divine Masculines, y'all manifested an ending for yourself, which is good. Because you realize if I'm the Empress, you got to be the Empress. So, you're more powerful or he is not equally powerful than the Empress. So, guess what? Tower, you manifested that shit. Good job. 22-22 as I said, man. And also, this magic is going back on your dome, Carmita. So, when you push it on out, mm-hmm. It's going to come right back to you. I was going to call you a bad name, but you know what? I ain't even going to do it. And you invested in some old dirt magic, some graveyard dirt, girl. You conjure up all your demons. So while you over there investing in your demon dirt, guess what? That's what you manifested. Good job. Thank you, Carmen. You know, I want to really thank you because, <laughs> yeah. I want to really thank you uh, because, and the emperor should thank you too, because all the magic you was conjuring up and you thought you was winning over there didn't do nothing but get you trapped. So you conjured up your own damn web. I told you be careful for the webs that you weave, huh? 2323 is going to get you trapped. And also, because you invested in trying to trap the masculines, the emperors, God's child. He don't play about none of his kids. So guess what? Tower for you. You going to jail. So be looking out for that. And Emperor, good job. Good job. What else, Holy Spirit? Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, working on trying to get the masculine stuck. Talking about he the father. You know he wasn't the father in the beginning. Oh, lying ass heifer. Yeah, you, you see what that said. Yeah. It's over, Karmics. It's over. July ass. Yeah, ain't no beginnings for you with your line ass. Ain't no gonna be no beginnings for you, huh? Yeah, you told somebody about some investment, some money, or some some situation. You thought you was boss talking about you gonna get somebody invested in something. Lying. And it wasn't even his child. You extra lie. And you ain't apologetic for nothing. That's why you finna get another tower. And you gonna keep getting these towers over and over and over and over and over again. 
and your vibe is low, it's gonna always be low because you're a low vibe person. Because you sat there and did moon magic every day. So every day, all that magic you conjured is going to come back home. Over and over and over and over and over. Because you keep going and you ain't stop. God said what he said. You looking out for that. Mars is in the building. Mars pissed off at y'all. Y'all don't even understand. It's a war out here in these streets right around now. Let's see what these old bitter bitches and bitter bums are be mad about. Okay, let me use a different deck for them. Let me see. Let's see. Why you mad, bitch? <laughs> why you mad? Let's see why they mad. Let's play a game of Monopoly because they like to play games. Let's get the board of Monopoly cards out here. They love to play mind games, don't they? Mm hmm since y'all love to play these mind games with the high priestess, oh, oh, because you lost. That's why you mad. And you know you losing, and you know you lost. Oh, because you was trying to be a high priestess with the devil. Oh, um, the devil wants his pearls, man. I can't stress this enough. Oh, you lied about some money. You told people you was going to give them some money. They going to have some new beginnings. Oh, you definitely going to jail. You stole some money too, Sash. Oh, you the one lied too, Sash. You are definitely a big old liar. So you stole some money, Aquarius. You you stole some money too. Both of y'all stole money and you're going down. All right. And you kept stealing people money over and over and over again, Spirit Sash. What's this, Spirit? What's this lying about some money? Yeah, they thought they could slow the divine masculines down and take their money, huh? Damn, that sucks. Yeah, because now you regret that shit, don't you? You regret taking action? Yeah, I bet you do. Because you're about to go to jail. What's with the Seven of Swords? What they lie about? Woo-wee! You guys going down. <laughs> Oh, they lied. Tell my they was healed. They ain't healed. Look at that. Oh, man. Looks like somebody water about to get cut off, too. And I'm not trying to talk about people that water get cut off. They water. Can, they, they supply is off. Yeah, they supply. Yeah. They supply. Mm-hmm. That energy gone. Yeah. You thought you could steal people energy and money? Yeah, ain't no more supply. Yeah, you mentally stuck, spirit saying. You trapped. You trapped. Ain't no more supply. Just because y'all was lying. Doing it round and round, huh? Trying to take people money and energy and wishing death on people. I know, because she kept going on and on and on and on and on and on. And on. Girl, you crazy. <laughs> I ain't never seen nobody do magic. I would want to say, Aquarius. I never in my life have even known, first of all, I didn't even know about black magic until you started, okay? And then second of all, you just kept going over and over and over. Girl, you even lost all your marbles. And, um, yeah, Queen of Wands, you next. Okay, ain't no success. You did it over and over and over and didn't get no success. I would be so salty. Yeah, you sad now. That's why you mad, because you sad, because you didn't get no success. And that's true, Spirit, say. Ace of Swords. Yeah, clarity came out, the truth came out, and guess what? They leaving you all behind, because you ain't getting no money. Yeah, and you was being manipulative. Tower, how many times we done seen the tower? This is the fourth tower tonight. King of Swords, cut that bitch off. Yeah, because he was the provider. Uh-huh. You was lying to this person. Tower. All for some money. You didn't get nothing but a page pencil. You did all that work for a page? Oh, wow. Yeah, and the High Priestess is the Knight of Swords because he's swiftly coming back to the High Priestess. The real one, right? Yeah. Not your fake ass. Bone question. Yeah. Hair front in the reverse. You stuck because you're getting a divorce and it ain't work. Mm. Because he in love with his true match. Yeah, I know. Sucks to be you, don't it? You shouldn't have been lying and faking like you was some high priestess. 
and you got a deep knowing this person leaving. Yeah, and now you're going to have to watch me work every day of your life. Spirit's saying. Hmm. Why be joyous and fruitful and plentiful and everybody else who you kept stealing from? Yeah, trying to slow the, the message down and slow this person from coming to the person he loved. God in the building. Yeah, he gonna come collaborate. Mm hmm mm hmm Tower. Because y'all was collaborating, trying to slow somebody down. Trying to block the love. You can't block destiny, girl. God said what he said. 30, 30 in the clock. And all you're going to do is just watch the business grow like it's growing now. And you're going to be in the page of pentacles. Uh-huh, because it's about to be a party, spirit say. <laughs> hey. Oh, yes. It's a party, spirit say. It's going to be a party. It's going to be a happy place. Witches' wishes is coming true. Twins is coming together. Everybody ascending in this peace. And even if twins ain't, the divine masculines is waking up to these fake ass fuck fakely empresses out here. And they getting happiness. And they getting their stuff together. And that is great. And all y'all gonna be is weary. Okay? You're gonna be in the weary defensive gardens. That's all y'all gonna be. King of Wands. That's right. Because this person took action to be by himself. To be alone and be a leader and be independent. You guys are sad about it. And you try to keep this person confused. Queen of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. And he waiting on his Queen of Pentacles. Because he misses Divine Feminine. And he going to wait. And he don't want y'all sorry pussy hoes. Because y'all ain't nothing but the devil. You go in jail. And it's going to be a beautiful, soulful relationship with the person that he truly loves. And ain't nobody gonna stop. And he gonna get his rest. And he gonna heal. And he gonna decide to go when it's ready. To give his cup and move on to his legacy. Boom, la da, la. And I'm gonna leave it there, guys. This was a beautiful reading. Because we got the victory. Twins is ascending. Towers is happening all over the world. I can't make it up. Cycle's completing now. God is in the building. Hey, you can't get no better than this. And once again, what goes around, 32, 32 on the clock, always come back around again. Deja vu tarot. Peace.